ain't catch a vibe, yeah, I had to put her on Bought a two-seater, yeah, we headin' for the sun Shawty got my high, I ain't trippin' for the fun What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Jacksons of Atlanta YouTube channel, guys. Listen, I'm your boy, Justin. Do me a big favor, hit the subscribe button, turn on those post notifications, and when you do, make sure you comment down below to let us know that you did so we can shout you out. Y'all already know our number's at the bottom of the screen. Send us a text right now so you can stay locked in with us. Also, guys, check out the third set of twins, baby registry, and the new house uh, warming uh, link as well. Uh, get you get something off that. Listen, you don't know what to get. Send a gift card. But anyway, y'all, I am up early this morning. Tired. I mean, tired, tired. Um, but get ready to jump in the shower. we uh been here uh, at the new house. Uh, we still ain't got all of our furniture in yet. Um, but things are coming along. Uh, we got some of the boxes uh, removed and. Pretty much, we haven't gotten everything like put up, but we've got it, you know, the boxes in the rooms that the boxes need to go in, I guess, be, you know, to be unpacked. But uh, this is the downstairs right here, as you can see. So that's some of the um, things that we, um, some some of the, uh, where, where a lot of the boxes were. So uh, we are still unpacking, uh, still getting ready to order all this furniture with our interior designer, but like I said, we get ready, I'm getting ready to jump in the shower. Mahogany's over here. As y'all can see, this is one uh, box right here we gotta unpack. Um, this is a lot of like makeup stuff and different uh, hair products of Mahogany's. Um, as y'all know, we got my shower right here. We ready to jump in. And then, as y'all know, I moved up, like I was saying, I moved up all of the boxes yesterday. As y'all can see, up here a lot of stuff now. I just gotta unload it. Uh, that was a job in itself, just pulling all that stuff upstairs, but it was work. I mean, it was real work, but my heart is in here going through getting her stuff out now. How you feeling this morning? Looking a little tired. Mm -hmm. I'm tired. Yeah. How you sleep last night? Good. It feels not long enough. <laughs> it never seems long enough these days. Sleep never seems long enough these days at all. But uh, yeah, guys, this is our closet. We just got to put everything up. So I'm going to be working to do that next. But I kind of had to do it instead. I had to bring the stuff in the house and yeah, bring it up steps. And then uh, now I'm going to do another day of just unpacking. Uh -huh. So it's, it's been definitely a huge process. So anyway, y'all, um, we got a uh, doctor for me today. So uh -huh. I'm getting ready to jump on in the shower because my hot water running. Uh, running up my water bill, so let me go and jump on in the shower. All right, y'all, so I just got out the shower from getting dressed. My Harvey just got out too. She's in there getting her little lotion on and stuff. I'm just ready to go ahead and wake the kids up. Um, and get them started. Get them, get them, get them boys up, y'all. Make sure I got everything in place to get them up. Cause soon as you get them up, it's over. It's over, y'all heard me? It is over. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and wake them up, get them some breakfast. Uh, so then we're gonna head on up out of here. So y'all see my new chain. Had to get, had to go on and upgrade a little bit. Had to go on and upgrade a little bit, but I'm gonna go on over here and uh, wake them up. Rise and shine. What you doing this morning? What you doing this morning? How you doing? You ready to get up? Looking a little so tired this morning. Looking a little so tired this morning. How you doing, uh, Mateo? You doing good? Y'all looking sleepy in here this morning. Y'all looking real sleepy. Looking real sleepy. How you doing? Mm -hmm. Oh, you upset this moment? Get ready to go and get dressed. You're gonna be fine. All right, y'all, so I officially have uh, Mateo Mallow uh, dressed and ready. Then he eating at breakfast this morning. How you doing, how your breakfast? 
good pancake. 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 The greatest there. How your breakfast this morning, Mom? Milo, you found it, adjusted yourself. You still, you still, still, you hanging in there? You feeling better now? You feeling better now? Yeah, I thought you were. You feeling better now? <laughs> All right, y'all, so I'm going to head upstairs um, and go uh, wake up Justin and Marcel so I can get them moving, uh, get out of here and check on my Agni, see where she is uh, in the process of getting ready. Uh, one thing about this house, y'all, she been getting up early. Uh, and she been here, so maybe, maybe I just had to buy the girl a new house. I don't know what it was. Um, but she been getting up early. Oh, yeah, she in here doing her hair and stuff. Mm -hmm. How you doing? How you doing? Whew, I dropped the phone. Uh, yeah, she in here, y'all doing her hair this morning. Hey, y'all. What you doing? Not much, just kind of doing my hair. And things like that. I'm feeling good. I feel like I need a little bit of coffee, but I mean, I'm definitely pushing and having a good day. And um, y'all know I'm wearing this curly hair, which I really love. Like, it's definitely different for me because I'm always used to just wearing, um, well, of course, I'm always used to wearing color, which I could have got this color, but I wanted it um, black. But I'm, I guess what I'm trying to say is I'm so used to wearing uh, hair that is not this texture. So this texture, um, you know, this requires you to keep it like moisturized and all that kind of stuff. And so before I head out for the day, I have to just make sure that we are all moisturized and everything like that. But I, I have just been love this one now. I think Zay was saying, I can't really hear him because I was in the bathroom, but I think he was saying something about I'm getting up early and all kind of stuff. But I truly tell you guys, your environment makes a huge, huge difference. Um, and just being here in this new house, I just have definitely felt more motivated to like get up, get ready for work, um, and different things like that. And it's definitely not something that's gonna wear off. It's just like, Cause you know, some people could be like, oh, well, why don't you get settled in and that'll wear off? But no, like, really, I felt like this, um, you know, before, like when I stayed at different places and stuff, your environment just makes a difference. I don't care what nobody say, your environment makes a difference. And of course, like, if you can't be in a nice environment or whatnot, you have to, of course, make the best of where you are, which I've always done, which my husband and I have always done. But when you do get into a nicer environment, it just makes you, it just motivates you to just do more and you just feel better and stuff. So I'm doing my hair. As y'all know, I would usually be doing my hair in like that little small bathroom um, right there by the kitchen. And uh, it was so much. Not enough space and just a lot. But I pushed through and now I finally have like a bathroom that's spacious, bacon coming here, the bathroom ain't sweating and being weird and stuff. Like, this bathroom has been everything. I mean, everything, you hear me? So, I'm just doing my hair. I should be done here shortly. And then we are getting ready to see you in the morning. So I just finished getting uh, Justin Marcel ready. Come on, Justin Marcel, let's roll. Uh, get ready to head downstairs, get that breath. Say good morning, uh, Justin. Say good morning. Say, hey, how you doing? All right, head on downstairs, get your breakfast. All right, how you doing, Marcel? Say, hey, say everybody. Yeah, uh, so they ready, got their shoes on. Y'all see your brothers down there, look. Say good morning. Good morning. You tell them good morning. Good morning. <laughs> they might have tell you and them have a conversation. Anyway, y'all, we ready here then to get them some breakfast. Uh, Just Marcel, do me a favor. Can y'all give me, uh, pick up them bottles, take them downstairs for me? Thank you. Justin, grab you too. That's good. That's good. All right. Grab you too. Hold on to the rail. Justin, where you going? Get two of the, Justin, go ahead, Marcia. 
Justin, come here. Two bottles. All right, hold on to the rail. Go downstairs. Go downstairs, buddy. Go downstairs. Take your time. Get you. Hold on to the rail. All right, there you go. All right, y'all. He going on down the steps. Uh, I'm getting ready to go and cook breakfast and everything. Got my big pack for the day. Uh, let me get ready to get on out of here, y'all. All right, y'all. So I um, officially uh, got the car uh, loaded. Uh, everybody's in. Uh, they out here in the garage. Y'all, I'm loving this garage. So everybody's in the car. Just and Marcia eating their breakfast on the go because we running a little bit behind. How y'all doing this morning? Hello. Hey, 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 hey. Let me tell you, Milo back there in the back, y'all. So we get ready to pull out of here shortly uh, to get going on up the road. We actually got to run by the old house today um because they're coming to get the wash and dry um and we still need to go over there straighten up and clean up a couple of things we still got like a little bit knickknacks some stuff in the cabinet and stuff but my heart is over here getting her purses together so y'all know her wall her room over there about to be summer yeah i'm excited so i can see everything that i have because like even right now it'd be like kind of hard to um get out like what shades am i going to wear what am i going to put on because you know you sometimes need to see everything like right in front of you and then i'm also gonna put all my stuff in like color coordination so like my browns my oranges so i got brown on boom brown shades you know you can kind of just go and see gotcha so, okay okay i see you yeah yeah, yeah. i forgot my jewelry up there so i just gotta run and get that real quick okay and then i will um be back and then i'll be ready to go all right we're gonna be i'll be out we're gonna be out there waiting on you all right, all right now i heard that the booty on up all right, y'all, let me give me something to drink and get on in the car. All right, y'all, so we are in the car. We're dressed. I got my earrings, like I told y'all, my shades. All my boys are in the back. One, two, three, four, and my babe. Um, and so now we're actually um, starting, to, getting the day started, but we're going to start first with prayer, of course, mm -hmm. um, to just kind of open up the day. So. Yes, Lord, y'all better go on by your head. This is prayer on the go. Yes. Let us pray. Lord God, we thank you, God, for this day. God, we give your name the praise, the glory, and all of the honor. God, we just thank you for being God and just God by yourself. For God being the God that um, God wakes us up and God gives us our being and gives us, gives us our movement. God, we thank you for being that God, that God that sits high and looks low. So, God, we thank you this morning that God... Uh, for all of the blessings that you are blessing us with, God, thank the healing, Lord. the miracles, the signs, the wonders. God, I thank you that, God, every day that we wake up, that, God, you um, look past our faults and you see our needs. You look past our faults and you see that we're still worthy mm -hmm. of the reward that you have for us, that you still let us press towards the mark, no matter how um, hard it may get, no matter how much uh, we may be at fault or sinful, God, that you still look upon us and you still bless us. So we thank you, God, for looking past of our messed up ways and still giving us the miracles and the blessings and giving us a second chance, oh God. God, we thank you this morning for everyone that's in this call, every child, God, from the youngest to the oldest. God, we thank you, God, for uh, myself. I thank you for my heart. God, that you will continue to touch this family in a mighty and special way. But God, not just touch our family, but touch those that are watching, touch those that are following us, touch those that are connected with us. God, touch them and bless their household, bless and meet their needs too. And God, we give your name the praise, the glory, and honor. And God, we know we just don't pray just for the day, God, but we pray that God, you continue to bless us even financially. That God, you will bless us where eyes have not seen and ears have not heard. Bless us with uh, expertise exponential, uh, more than enough, too much than enough, a whole lot than enough, God, wealth, God, we thank you that you are, God, making our, our bank accounts even bigger, and God, not only blessing us financially, but blessing us emotionally, and God, uh, 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 just blessing us holistically, and God, we give your name the praise, the glory, and the honor, it is you that we pray, amen. Amen, amen. Y'all, we're on the way to the old house first and mm -hmm. open up the door for them uh, so they can get this washer and dry and bring it on down and get this body wash clothes. Okay. You need to wash and have that machine running. <laughs>
All right, y'all, so we just made it uh, down here to Mahogany's um, appointment today. Um, I'm getting ready, to, uh, I'm dropping her off in the front right now. Uh, she finishing some up, uh, some administration work on her computer, uh, but I'm um, getting ready to drop her out. And uh, the babysitter's gonna be meeting us here soon so she can sit with the kids uh, while uh, we go into the appointment. So uh, here she come now. You got the door locked for safety, don't you? Uh, come on in, getting there, doing your work on your computer, huh? Yeah, finishing up some early morning work. That's about it. Okay. Um, shut my computer down. Y'all know they got me a new computer, so I like to make sure I shut it down right and ain't got it messing up and glitching. But I'm going to just toss it in my book bag. Okay, well, go on to your point before you be late now. I know, I ain't trying to be late, y'all, because listen. Oh, let me get the mask. Yeah, because they said they canceling your appointments if you don't come up with a mask. Yeah, everybody doing that now, y'all. If you ain't got a mask, they're turning you away. So you away. make sure y'all got masks. I don't want you to get out, get all the way there and they don't accept you. Right, uh, -huh. uh, did I get? Do I have your phone? You want to take my phone? Uh uh, she'll be sitting over in there. Okay. All right. But yeah, y'all I'm getting ready to head on this to my appointment. All right. So I'm heading on this to my appointment. Oh, I gotta go to the bathroom so, so bad. I'm trying to hold it because you know they be wanting you to pee in the cup and stuff. Got my mask, about to put that on. Oh, but I gotta go to the bathroom so bad. And baby was waiting on the babysitter, but she actually pulled up when I was getting out. But I couldn't even wait because y'all have to go to the bathroom so bad. So I'm gonna see when I get up here if they're gonna do like a thing. Because they did it before. That don't mean they always gonna do it, but <laughs> let me kind of go in advance and use the bathroom. Like, and then they just, you know, test my sample ahead of time. Cause y'all, I gotta pee like it ain't no tomorrow. Sorry if that's too TMI for some of y'all, but. Whew. So I'm getting off the elevator. All right. And I am getting ready to head on in. It smells so fresh in here. I love it. Love it, love it. Hello. Hi. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good, Mahogany Jackson. Thank you. Okay, God, your girl got her uniform. I'm able to get that done because I have to go to the bathroom so, so bad, like I told y'all. So I'm getting ready to do this now. Y'all already know the process. I mean, I feel like we've all done this before, but I'm getting ready to do mine um, and get that out of the way. So I'm going to do it. Okay, So I have made it on in. Um, I am in my room waiting to see my doctor. So I'm so excited. Here's a little bump shot right now. Um, so here we are. Moving right on along. Moving right on along. Um, but so far I did my blood pressure, which was good. It was 117 over 77. Yeah, 117 over 77, which was good. Yes, yes, yes. And then secondly, I did my urine sample, which they didn't tell me the results of that one. I'm assuming everything's good. I mean, but the doctor should let me know. Um, and so, what else did we do? I think that's about it. That was the color of your pee. On too yellow, was it? No, it was perfect. They say if it's hot yellow, you ain't drinking enough water. No, I'm feeling hydrated and I didn't drink enough water. You sure? Yeah. Because she's going to ask you to die and I'm going to tell her you just started drinking a lot of water. Not true. That's not the true. truth. Not true. That's the truth. If I'm lying, I'm flying. And I ain't lifted off the ground yet. No, he is so. I've been doing good with my water. I can feel it. And I had me a smoothie this morning, so that made me feel really good. Mm -hmm. um, but now I'm going to get ready to go to the doctor. Get my blood pressure check. Um, check my blood pressure. Do the 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 what the updates is and how everything's going. So, let's see. It's looking good. Getting big. I know, right? Getting big. I'm officially in jumpsuit slash anything that's stretchy season. So, we are uh, now leaving out the uh, doctor's office. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, but how, you, how did everything go today? Oh, y'all. Oh, my gosh. I am just so, so nervous about what she said. Mm -hmm. I told you this was one of my concerns. So, it's like... Oh gosh. I what? But I mean, I feel, I feel, I feel good, and I'm happy with all my like, results that were good. But I'm just nervous. Um, 
because I hate things being so unexpected. Mm -hmm. And, oh, Lord, Bobby. I hate things being so unexpected. And so, have a good process. Yeah. Uh oh. Did you get two again? Uh oh. All right, hit the eleven. Don't I get... did. Oh, okay. Probably somebody else might hit the elevator. Oh, probably did. So, oh, there it go. You know, you a perfect jump ball. Gotta hit the dough for you. Oh, my gosh. But, yeah, overall, it was a great appointment, though. Yeah, yeah. Definitely um, good. We'll update you guys on what she said um, about everything. Um, but, yeah, overall, good appointment. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely good appointment. Yeah. 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 I mean, everything's good. That's good. Okay. Just unexpected, but good. Yeah, I'll good. take it. I'll yeah. Take it. So, guys, we're heading on back to the car to uh, meet the babysitter and get the other little, My other, babies. other little monctions real quick. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, we are now getting ready to grab some uh, lunch before uh, we head. I'm back uh, before we hit the Walmart. Then we gotta go uh, head back home. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, y'all ready to go get something to eat? You know these kids always ready. They ready. Y'all ready? Ready to eat, Marcel? What you want to eat? Oh, bread. Yeah, that's what we are. Some bread. Says, says bread. So y'all, we are at the Olive Garden. At the Olive Garden, one of our favorite places, because y'all know you get that bread. And you get salad. And, and that you salad. Get food. I mean, you know, you get so much. A little bit of everything. Yep. Family, I think it's always good. Yep, definitely is. So we headed on inside, lugging these big kids. How you doing, uh, Mateo? How you be? You getting big and heavy? Got to start walking. It's too much for me. Woo, you got you got your dad out here sweating. Out here in this humidity. Out here in this humidity. It does. All right, guys. So. um I am cutting up the food for the kids. Yeah, this is messy. I might have to feed them this too. Yeah, well, I took Milo's away. Yeah, um, but guys, uh, we ended up getting the little twins pizza and fries. Um, we ended up getting Justin and Marcel pizza and uh, fries and grapes. Um, and then they all had bread. Mateo took Marcel off of his salad because he loves salad. And um, I ended up getting the chicken Alfredo with... Uh, Rotini noodles because they didn't have my favorite, which is cavatappi. And then Bay, he ended up getting the, I got the strip Alfredo, y'all. Why you got a slice of pizza on there? Oh, you said Milo's pizza. Milo's pizza over here because it's getting messy. What y'all doing? What y'all trying to share some? I think Milo looking for some more pizza. Hey, Milo, <laughs> hey. how your food, Justin? Is it good? Good. Marcel, how your food? Good. All righty. All right, y'all, we're about to go on, dig in and enjoy. Yes, yes, and yes. So we just got into uh, Walmart. So uh, So did. took us a minute to get up here, y'all. It's hot. It's hot as hell. I it say. It's hot. Hot. Uh, I'm telling you, y'all. I'm about to stay in the. How about to camp out? I'm like, I'm, I'm serious. I love my house so much. Yesterday I was in the house for like a good amount of time, and it felt good. Like I don't even. When your house night, like you don't even mind being at home. But just, just leave me at home. Listen, I just told y'all. Just leave me at home. If there is no AC, there is sure enough no me. And it's getting ridiculous. For sure. I'm about to go to Alaska for the damn summer. Oh, yeah, right. I'm about to go to you Alaska. Enjoy it though. I, I probably enjoy it. I probably up there enjoying it. Feet up and everything. I'll probably freeze, but you would probably have a really good time. Yeah. But anyway, y'all, we came to Walmart to get some groceries. Uh, a little bit of things that we need for the heist yeah. um, at the new place because we don't have it there yet. Uh, so we up in this Walmart. We up in this new Walmart. So yeah. it's like they stay in stock with most and stuff. I, and, and 
I love. Yeah, because that one we lived near over in Union City, yeah. they didn't have nothing. It always was something was always out of stock. Y'all to substitute something. But anyway, y'all, let us go and get this list together. All right, y'all. So we are ringing up now. We got so much stuff. Um, these are like some fresh veggies and frozen veggies here. And then Babe has like pampers, rice. Um, they have some canned goods down there. It all depends, y'all. I ain't gonna make no promises, but when we get home, we might do like a grocery haul, kind of showing y'all what all we did get from the store. But I ain't gonna make no promises. Um, but we got a good amount of stuff, guys. Look like they got some boxers, um, some cream cheese, a lot of stuff. Tonight, I plan on making like a sheet pan type of meal where I can put like some chicken breast on, um, some chicken breast on like the sheet pan with some fresh vegetables mixed with a few frozen vegetables. So I think that's going to turn out really, really good. Comment down below, y'all, some things y'all want me to cook in the new house um, to give you guys some ideas. But Bay's ringing up everything right now. How was y'all store run? It was good. Quick. Quick, quick. Good. That's really good. So I'm excited, y'all. Everything's going good. We're just unloading. As y'all see, the kids are helping. Wait for a second. Um, they're, they're helping, they're such good helpers. Uh, Mateo and Milo be wanting to help, but you know, it just don't make sense. So that's pretty much it, y'all. We loading all this stuff up. We're gonna ring everything up and then we're gonna be heading on out of here because we got one more errand we need to run before we go back to the house. So we have made it back to the house. We made it back to the house, just brought all of the groceries in, as you can see. Mahogany's over here putting everything up. Y'all yeah. know she about to get fancy with it. Mm -hmm. What, you get ready to organize and stuff? Try to. I need to organize, how I put this in there. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how I put that in there. That's Y'all know she taking care of her new refrigerator, ain't that right? Listen. I know, getting it all organized. Y'all know me, pray for me that I keep it organized. Yeah. Cause you know me. Milo, what you trying to do down here? Drink a little water. See, I need a little water. Need a little water. Need a little water. Mm -hmm. Need a little water. Bye -bye. What you talking about? Huh? You be talking. No, you, you be talking. What you talking about? <laughs> huh? What you talking about? Huh? It's crazy to say. Just must. He's going to have a full conversation. You hear him? Yeah, ain't that the truth. Ain't true. But anyway, what we get from the store? So, y'all, um, we got... Um, some frozen items, like if you see right down here, I got like, uh oh. Wanna drop something? Yeah, down there we got, um, let me make sure chicken see. nuggets. We oh. got some chicken nuggets. We got some fries. Uh, what? Look, look how you open this bag. No. Y'all, y'all cousins be doing this like. I'm not supposed to seal that up, y'all. Don't worry about I'm it. I'm supposed to seal that up. Just seal it up. And the refrigerator is telling you it's been open too long. That's why it's reminding me, but I'm right here, so I don't need to be reminded. You need to be reminded. <laughs> That's good. Don't be having my refrigerator open too long. Mm. Y'all yeah, already been walking around here cutting the lights out. Listen. Listen. Been shutting it down. I don't know with the lights as well. Huh? Yeah, that's you. <laughs> he thought, all right, y'all. So what else we get? We're going to show y'all what else we got real um, quick. We brought some pancakes for the kids. Yeah. Let me get over here while you putting stuff in. Okay. Uh, let's see what else, guys. We bought some uh, pancakes for the kids. We got some carrots uh, from the store. We also got some bagels yeah. uh, that we needed. For breakfast. Yeah, for breakfast. Um, what else did we get? I got some underwear. These daggone underwear, y'all. Um, they make sense. It's crazy. Was it fourteen dollars? For three packs of underwear. That's that makes no sense. That's right. So I had got some underwear because we're still waiting for the wash and dryer to get there, y'all. Uh, we were supposed to go by the house today and actually pick up the, uh, meet them to pick up the wash and dryer, but they're going to end up coming tomorrow. So that was a waste of a Waste of our time. Waste of our time stopping by there. <sighs> but uh, anyway, wash and dryer should be down here, hopefully, um, no. by Monday. Yeah, Monday, yeah. Yeah, at the latest. Uh, what's that? This is zucchini blend, so like frozen zucchini. Mm. I was gonna get some and chop it, but I was just like, I got enough fresh stuff. Yeah. Fresh and nice dinner, so. Gotcha. All right, y'all. So we got a little bit, little chicken breast, little coffee creamer. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go and put all this up right quick.
Alrighty, y'all. So uh, we just finished uh, putting up the groceries. Mm -hmm. um, like Milo didn't make it. He got tired. Yeah, he did. So he went on upstairs and went to sleep. Yeah. <laughs> um, so <laughs> that sounds good. Taking a nap. Woo, that's, don't what, that's what I need to do in my life. That's what I need to do. Yeah, but Mateo's still hanging on. Yeah, that's what I said. They actually went in there and they put their blanket on too. They go on to sleep. They taking them a nap too. Yeah. You say hey. Hey. Say hello. <laughs> yeah. He'd be waving in the uptime though. Uh -huh. Yeah, camera. Camera. Yep. <laughs> but anyway, uh, so how did the appointment go today? Um, uh, well it went good. Um I just I'm bring him over here so I can sit him on here because listen, you ain't gonna hurt my back now. Um but yeah, it went good. Um she was just saying that which she said this before. I guess it's just becoming very more real and um, it's just getting crazy. Mm -hmm. As far as, you know, what she said, as far as like, um, shoot, I'm having pregnancy brain. But pretty much what she said about like the delivery and yeah. everything, as far as like it being unexpected, not knowing, yeah. you know? Um, because as you guys know, I always get induced. Um, every twin pregnancy that I've had, I've been induced. My first, Excuse me, my first one with Justin and Marcel, it was like a median induced because they were like, they couldn't grow no more in my stomach. And then with J Mateo and Milo, I was induced at 38 weeks. And so we still have things set, but she's just saying that she feels like, like it's still unexpected, like because mm -hmm. it's the third pregnancy. Yeah. She's like, you know, it, you don't know where it's gonna gauge. You mm -hmm. don't know because Mateo, Justin and Marcel were 35, Mateo and Milo were 38. We could go past that. We could go in the middle. Mm -hmm. Like, it's just unexpected. And y'all, I don't like unexpected. So yeah. we still have things set, but I don't like unexpected. No, I don't either. I don't either. I don't like, I don't like it at all. So it's like, ugh, you know. And she said this is just a third pregnancy thing. Your third pregnancy, she said the labor is quicker and it can sometimes just be unexpected. Yeah. Well, you guys comment down below. Let us know what you guys think. Uh, but we get ready to get out of here. Thank you for rocking with us today. But listen, hit the subscribe button, turn on those post notifica notifications. Mm -hmm. Today's shout out notification winner goes to Shamika Green. Shamika Green. Mm -hmm. Shout out to you, Shamika Green. Listen, we love you guys so much. Guys, until next time, I'm. I was speaking with this rich man. They uh -huh. gave me this at the doctor's office. Yeah. But listen, until next time, I'm your boy Justin. And I'm Mahogany. And listen, guys, remember, guys, if you keep it locked, we're going to show enough to keep it lit. We out of here. Peace. <laughs> Shawty catch a vibe, yeah, I had to put her on Bought a two-skitter, yeah, we heading for the sun Shawty got my high, I ain't trippin' for the fun 